So, we need to plant some potatoes here. I love potatoes. Ready, now we will wait for the harvest. Hi, JJ. What? Who are you? It's me, Mikey. Don't you recognize me? No, you don't look like Mikey at all. Although, wait, the head is the same as Mikey. JJ, I've just become the most powerful being on the planet now. How did you do that, Mikey? You were just normal this morning, and now you've become several times bigger. I made a deal with the devil. A deal with the devil? It can't be. Where did you find him? Well, Mikey, so you want to become the most powerful being on the planet. Do I understand you correctly? Do you want to be the strongest on this planet? Yes, yes! I want to be huge and strong so that everyone is afraid of me, so that I can handle any villain, to be so huge that I couldn't even walk through my door. I will do anything for you to fulfill this wish. Hmm, okay, Mikey. We can make a deal with you. But in exchange for this gift, you must fulfill one small condition. What condition should I fulfill? You're going to clean my house all week. Exactly seven days of thorough cleaning in my house, and you will become the most powerful creature on the planet. I guarantee it to you. Hmm, to clean the house? That's it? Okay, I agree. It's so easy. Okay, Mikey, you can start in exactly seven days. I will make you the strongest. But don't try to mess around. The house must be completely cleaned. Okay, I'm off. Your house will be the cleanest. Good luck to you. So, here, I also see the earth. How dirty everything is here. Why is there so much dirt in this house? It looks like no one has ever cleaned it at all. Probably the demon should hire a maid in this house. I've never seen so much dirt in one place. It looks like the demon doesn't like cleaning at all. Now I need to throw it all away. I've only been here for the first day, and I'm already very tired. But never mind. I'll definitely deal with it in exchange for strength. I will succeed. That's how it is. Now I'm the strongest. Look at me. Haha. <laughs> Mikey, did you clean a demon's house for giving you power? Haha, <laughs> Mikey. This is very funny. What's funny? I don't see anything funny here. Guys, we urgently need your help. Our village was attacked by bandits. I came running to you from a nearby village for help. Please help us out. Were you attacked by bandits? Of course we will help you. Look at my friend. Yes, I'm going to test my strength right now. You came on time. Let's run to our village as soon as possible. There they are. They've already started setting fire to our village. We can't handle these bandits. Don't worry. We'll put them back in place quickly. Yeah, they're about to get what they deserve. For now, hide somewhere. I'll deal with them quickly. Thank you very much. I hope you will succeed. Save our village. No problem. It's my duty to help good people. Well, JJ, stand somewhere near Villager. Guard him, and I'll go deal with the bandits. What? Are you going to fight them alone? Are you sure? Yes, I'm 100% sure. Leave this matter to me. Good luck, Mikey. If anything, call me. I'll come to the rescue right away. Haha. <laughs> well, bandits, come here. Now I'll show you real strength. Haha, <laughs> I destroy them with one hit. The demon did not deceive me. I am now really the strongest on this planet. I cannot be defeated. You are such weaklings. Thank you guys so much, you saved our village. It remains for us to rebuild the village after the attack. Well, nothing, we will quickly deal with it. You can call us for help at any time. Mikey can now cope with any problems. Yes, I was only glad to help you. Guys, please take the reward from our village. It will be useful to you. Wow, diamonds. Thank you so much, I love diamonds. Come visit us as soon as you have time. We will definitely come. We were glad to help you so far. See you later. Have a nice day. Wow, Mikey, the demon didn't deceive you. You really are the strongest now. Yes, it's true. Well, let's go to bed. It's already so late. Come on. Hey, JJ, I can't go into the house. The passage is too small. Indeed, you are now so huge that you cannot enter the house. Well, it's good that I have a hatchet with me. Now I'll make a passage for you. However, now we don't have a suitable door. Are we going to leave the entrance open? It's okay. No one will come in here for sure. And if a robber shows up here, I'll deal with him right away. Okay, Mikey. I think you can get through now. Yes, great. I can enter the house. And now we can go to bed. 
the room is also too small for me now. I can only walk here in a semi-oath now. And the bed is too small for me too. Well, never mind. I'll rebuild our house and make rooms the right size. What? What's wrong with me? I've shrunk. It can't be. Have I been bewitched? It must have been those robbers from the village we were defending today who decided to put a curse on me. Or maybe a demon did it. I need to know urgently. What? What are those sounds? Does Mikey have a rat? I need to check it out. Mikey, what have you got there? Mikey, what happened? Why are you so small now? I don't know. I just got smaller. I do not know why. They probably put a spell on me. Hmm. Mikey, maybe a demon did it? You didn't know all the terms of your deal. I knew everything. I clean his house, and then I become the strongest. It seems to me that you didn't finish something. I went to the demon. I will urgently find out what happened to me. I don't want to be so small. Hey, demon, look at me. Wow, Mikey, hi, how are you doing? How are I doing? Look at me. I'm small now, the size of a rat. Why did I become like this? How come you and I made a deal? It's okay. Every night you will become the size of a rat. You will have to hide, haha. <laughs> but I don't want to be like that. You and I agreed that I would become the strongest after I cleaned your house. And in the end, what? I'm small and defenseless. We didn't agree on this. And what do you want from me now? I want to get back to my old self. Well, Mikey, then you'll have to completely put all the dirt that was in my house back in place. What? Bring back all the dirt? But why? Haha, <laughs> this will be a lesson for you. I will clean up all the dirt that you return to the next one who comes to me. Remember, you can't get anything for nothing. Okay, I'm off. How come I have to do the same job now, just the other way around? This demon is not normal at all. Okay, now I'll quickly fulfill his conditions, return to my previous state, and go home to sleep. I'm so tired, I wish I hadn't come here at all. Why did I do that? Thanks for watching, friends. Subscribe and like. And also, don't forget to click on the bell so that you don't miss new videos. Bye bye. Mikey, what a delicious soup you've made. Thanks, JJ. I tried my best. Where did you learn to cook like that? I learned everything by myself. Did you really like it? I really liked it. Hello, everyone, friends. Today is such a beautiful day, and Mikey has prepared a very tasty dish, for which we thank him very much. JJ, how about going outside? Shall we play ball, for example? Yes, it's a very good idea. I'm just full of energy and ready to play any game. Then let's go. Yes, let's run. Mikey, look, there's someone standing by the woods. Yes, I see it. I do not know who it is, but who could it be? Interesting. Let's go and take a look. Let's run. Hello, green man. What's your name? Hi, guys. My name is Shrek. What are you doing here, green man? I just went to the toilet, and when I came out of the toilet, I found myself here. Why is everything square here? Where is my swamp? Uh, Shrek, you're in Minecraft. What? What else is this? Guys, I need to go home. My friends are waiting for me there. Can you give us some time? Yes, I agree. Let me give you a little tour of our village. It will take five minutes, and then you will come back home, okay? And if I can't get home already? Hmm, an interesting question. If it arises, we will definitely solve it. Well, come with us. Okay, you talked me into it. This is where we grow vegetables, and then Mikey makes very tasty soups from them. Hmm, so you're eating carrots? Yes, there are also potatoes and beets. Oh, I don't like that. I love boiled slugs, a real treat. Ugh, how can you eat that? We will definitely treat you to our dishes sometime. Let's move on. And this is our mayor's house. The mayor? Do you have a mayor? Yes, the real mayor of our village. He is the most honest and kind mayor in the world. If so, then you and your village are very lucky. By the way, he has a beautiful house. Thank you. I will definitely tell him about it. Let's move on. And this is our home. What? Is this huge building your home? Yes, we live here with Mikey. Wow, it's a very beautiful house. Yes, we've been building it for a very long time. I'm glad you liked it. I wouldn't mind living in it myself. Come visit us for sure.
Well, guys, thanks for the tour. I will definitely come to visit you sometime. Yes, be sure to come. We will be waiting very much. See you again. Uh, what is it? It definitely wasn't here before. And how to use it? Maybe this is some kind of teleporter in their world. Hmm, maybe you need to get on it. What? What is it? What's wrong with me? I've been reunited with this device. No! What should I do now? We urgently need to run to those guys and ask for help. Guys! Mikey, how cool is it? We have a new friend. Yes, I agree. Stop, JJ, look back. There's someone outside the door. What? Shrek? It's you. But what's the matter with you? Why is your head in the toilet? I do not know. This thing appeared in the place I came from. Is this your toilet? Why did I reunite with him? I do not know, Shrek. It's okay. We'll figure something out. We just need to calm down. I urgently need to go home. My loved ones are waiting for me. Who will keep an eye on my swamp besides me? Don't worry, we will solve this problem. Object found. The Skibidi toilet is three meters away from me. Start eliminating the object. Wait, wait. There is no need to eliminate anyone. This is our friend. Eliminate the object. No, no. This is our friend who turned into this monster. Someone set him up. He needs help. Hmm. Someone turned him into a monster, you say? Yes. Did someone set him up? Yes, I'm telling you honestly. If that's really the case, then you all need to come with me. Why should we follow you? Will you help us? Yes, I will send you to a special place. There is an antidote for this disease. But remember, if no one turned him, then he will die. Everyone follow me. Guys, let's go after him. This is our only chance. Well, welcome to our base. Wow, where are we? This is a secret location. To get the antidote, you need to go through a small test. A test for us? It's easy for me. Be careful. Don't look down. It's very high up here. I'll meet you at that building. Good luck. That's it. I'm starting. I don't want to be in the toilet. I want to be in the swamp. Go ahead. Hey, Shrek, wait for us. I'm jumping, Mikey. Mikey, you need to be careful here. We're almost there. I'm going ahead. Just a little more. There's not much left. The last stage. Great! You completed the task quickly. Now there is a building in front of you, inside of which lies the antidote. But before you enter there, take a weapon from the chest. You'll need it. Oh yes, I forgot. Only one person can enter the building. Hmm, that person will be me. Come on, JJ. Good luck to you. I believe in you. Antidote lies at the very end. Good luck. Haha! <laughs> on you! That's for you! Ha ha! You can't win! You're going to get it now! Ha ha! Get it! How do you like it? Great! I've dealt with all the monsters! The antidote is in my hands! I passed it and will save Shrek! We did it! Well, JJ, you really surprised me. You're really willing to do a lot to save your friends. That's commendable. Now use the antidote. Throw it at your friend. Good! Super, I'm back. I am very glad. JJ and Mikey, thank you so much for your help. You are real friends. You're welcome, Shrek. We couldn't leave you in trouble. As I told you, we can definitely find a solution to this problem. Well, friends, thank you again. I am glad that I met such brave guys like you. Thank you very much. And we are also very glad to meet you. Come visit me. I will introduce you to my swap. Okay, Shrek, see you later. Bye-bye. We will miss you very much. Bye, guys. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you all for watching, friends. Subscribe and like. Bye-bye. I need to make a workbench. For this, I will cut down this tree. I think I should get more wood. I'll make myself some sticks for tools. 
Hey, Mikey, what are you doing? Hi, JJ. I'm chopping down a tree. I see. Do you chop this tree with your hand? Well, yes. I just forgot my tools at home, and it takes too long to go back, so I chopped down a tree with my hand. Don't you think, Mikey, that breaking wood with your hand is a bit unrealistic? Not realistic? What do you mean? Well, I mean, you won't break a tree like that in your life. It's really true. I can't break a tree with my hand. Listen, let's play Minecraft with a realistic mod. Everything in Minecraft will become like in real life. You will have to extract resources in a completely different way. It sounds interesting. Let's try it. Great. Then let's get started. And as the game progresses, I'll teach you. Wow, this mod is changing the world a lot. It looks different now. Yes, Mikey, that's right. Now a completely different survival process awaits us. Interesting. It will probably be very interesting to play Minecraft with a realistic mod. Yes, there are a lot of interesting things waiting for us. JJ, look, there's a tree there. I'm going to try to break it now. Mikey, you won't succeed. The tree just won't fall out. I'll find out now. Hmm, somehow it takes too long to break. It shouldn't be like this. Mikey, you're not going to make it. Drop it. The tree is being cut down in a different way here. You won't be able to get this tree in the usual way. And then how do I do it? You need to collect sticks and stones that you can find on the grass. Sticks and stones that are lying on the grass? It's interesting. I'll try to look for it. Mikey, there they are, all around. We will already be able to make an axe out of them, with which we will extract wood. Yes, I see it. Let's start collecting resources. Here, Mikey, look carefully. There are sticks and stones on the ground. Collect as many of them as possible. They will be very useful to us. Okay, I'll collect everything I see. Great. Now let's collect some stones and sticks, make an axe, and cut down a tree. So, as far as I remember, the stone should be knocked out in this way. Great, the axe headband is ready. Now I can make an axe. To do this, you need to connect the head of the axe with a stick. Super, now I have the axe in my hands. I'm ready to chop down a tree. So Mikey, look, now we can get some wood for us. You see? Cool, JJ, we have a tree now. Yes, now let me go cut down the trees and you're going to collect rocks and sticks. Yes, I agree, let's go. Well, Mikey, did you get a lot of resources? I have 15 logs here. That's enough for us for the first time. Yes, I collected all the sticks that I saw on my way. Send them to me and I'll show you something. What do you want to do with them? I will make a bonfire on which we will roast food. Wow, so much. You did your best, Mikey. Now step back, please. I'll light a bonfire in this corner. And how to make it? First, I'll make a flint from two sticks. Next, I'll throw some sticks and one log on the ground and start burning a bonfire. It probably won't work the first time. Great, it worked out. Now we have a bonfire. This is very cool, JJ. Now I'm going to throw some logs into the fire. You always need to keep the fire burning so that the fire doesn't go out. So now I'm going hunting. We need to get food. We are in a very good place. There are a lot of animals grazing here. There are a lot of pigs around. They all run away from me because they are afraid of me. Well, never mind. I'll catch up with them because we need to eat something. The first pig has been captured. Now I will start hunting for the second one. The second one is there. Great, I got as many as eight pieces of meat. That's enough for the first time. It's not worth mining a lot because it will just rot in my inventory. Well, I'm going to cook. Hey, Mikey, I got some meat for us. Cool, JJ, I'm very hungry. Now, I'm gonna start roasting meat on a campfire. It's a pity you can only roast meat on it one piece at a time. Really? We'll be frying food for a very long time then. It's okay, Mikey. This is the initial option, while we will use what we have. One piece of meat is ready. Take Mikey. Thank you very much. While you were gone, I also did not sit around and got some blocks of earth from which I will build a small shelter for us. A shelter made of blocks of earth? Interesting. Yes. Well, it won't be bad to start with, just to hide from the monsters. Mikey, you won't be able to build a shelter. Blocks of earth will just roll down. They have the same physics as sand. You will not be able to make walls out of the earth. Really? Why is that? Where are we going to hide? Really, I can't do anything. Mikey, let's go explore the area further. Come on. You, JJ, I am so tired and very thirsty. Where can we get water? We need to find a source of fresh water, Mikey. Usually it's a small lake. Then let's go look for him quickly. I'm going to die of thirst. Yes, let's go look for it soon. I'm very thirsty too. 
JJ, look, there's water here. Let's drink it. Mikey, unfortunately, we won't be able to drink it because it's a hot spring. And a hot spring is always very salty. He won't quench our thirst. What should we do then? I'm very thirsty. Unfortunately, you won't be able to use it, Mikey. Let's keep looking. I'm sure we'll find something for sure. We just need to find a lake with fresh water. It will definitely be in the forest. Let's run quickly. Look, JJ, and is this cold water? Yes, it's definitely her. You can drink from here. Phew, I finally quenched my thirst. I almost died. It's okay, Mikey. We need to take water with us on the road. Unfortunately, we do not have a container to take water with us. We can find clay and make a jug out of it. Only this jug will need to be fried to make it hard. JJ, how difficult everything is here. Bonfires, water, jugs, stones are not my thing at all. It's very difficult to survive here. I agree with you. That's why this mod is called Realistic. Listen, JJ, let's play with this mod some other time. Well, it's really all so complicated. I liked it more like in a regular Minecraft, breaking a tree with my hand. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, Mikey, I'm not going to force you. Let's play with this mod another time. Thanks for watching, friends. Subscribe and like. And also, don't forget to click on the bell so that you don't miss new videos. Bye-bye.